This is what it was like watching 12,000 people all boo one coach. I felt like I arrived a little late, but I still made it in time for the best part. When Cooley walked out of the tunnel, it was some of the loudest boos I've ever heard. And the fans were just getting warmed up. But Cooley was actually embracing the villain role, hugging fans courtside, giving thumbs up, and smiling. By tip off, I realized this was going to be one of the best college basketball environments of the entire year. And as the game went on, the fans were loving it. And Providence looked like the much better team, but Georgetown just kept hanging around. And you could tell, Cooley wanted this one. The chants were ruthless the entire game. It wasn't a moment where the dunk went quiet. Well, at least until 2.57 left in the game. When Georgetown took a three point lead after trailing the entire half, it felt like the Friars could actually lose. The pressure did not get to them and the moment did not last long. 